Hey guys, welcome to Excel Shortcut Funda. This is Abhishek Bhatt. Today I am going to explain you the some formulas regarding count. I will explain you total four formulas. One is a count. Second one is a count a. Third one is a count if, and fourth one is a count if s. So basically, count formula is used to get the total count of the filled cells. So let's suppose I want to, I want to take the count of this all total cells that uh, to there are how much how much total cells are there. So here I will give one formula is equal to count, and I will select this range. Will close the bracket and I will place and pr press enter. So here we have total twelve. Here we have total twelve cells, or we can say total twelve rows. Now let's suppose. This formula is this. Uh, I have applied this formula for the particular column in which we have the data filled with number. Now let's suppose I want to take the count for this month column. Then uh, I will try to apply that formula here also. So here I am go I am going to write apply that formula is equal to count, and we'll select this range and we'll close bracket and place press enter. So here it is showing the value as zero, because count formula only works for the numeric values. If we have the value in text, and we want to take the count of it, then we can apply one another formula. It is called as count a. So here I will write is equal to count a. I will select this range, will close the bracket and press enter. So here also we get the same value twelve. Now third formula is count if. It is same as a sum if that uh, if you want to take the count for particular those cells which have the specific value greater than or equal to or less than our condition means which is fulfilling our condition. So here I am going to take the count for those cells. Which are which having the value greater than twenty. So here I am going to apply that formula is equal to count if I will select the range. Then we'll give one comma and in inverted comma I will give my condition. So it's is equal to. Twenty. I will close inverted comma. I will close the bracket and will press enter. So here in total, five cells. We have the value greater than twenty. Now I will explain you the formula of count if a. Means where I want to give the two conditions that suppose uh, this uh, the value this count should be greater than fifteen, okay, and here the here the value should be greater than three hundred. So I am going to apply that formula here is equal to count if s. will select the criteria then will give condition then that it should be greater than 15 inverted then i will close the inverted comma will give one comma i will select the second range that revenue should be greater than 300 so i will select that range of revenue and will uh, will give my condition in inverted comma so it should be greater than 300 and i will close my bracket and will press enter so here also we get the same value that uh, count should be greater than 15 and revenue should be greater than 300 so we will we will get the total of those row which have the count greater than 15 and revenue greater than 300 
so this is how we can apply the formula count count a count if and count if s that's it for the day guys thank you very much for watching if this video is helpful to you then please do not forget to like it if you have any concern or suggestion then please comment below and do not forget to subscribe my channel for more upcoming videos again thank you very much guys thank you very much for watching have a happy learning